Well, when basically when we moved in, we only found out the day after how, how horrendous it was. It normally starts at around about 5, 5.30. Um, you can hear the, the, the HGVs um, perfectly past, so much so um, that the, the vibration goes under the bed. Um, so we have to go to, um, to, to sleep with earphones, with earplugs in, because we know we're going to get woken up. Um, so we're awake every morning at 5, 5.30. Five, five um, I can't open the windows. I've got a fan because I'm working from home at the moment. I have a fan that's um, constantly on. I uh, can't open any of the windows because it's constant. It's absolutely constant. And it's been horrendous. And I understand the lorries are, are particularly troublesome for you though. Absolutely horrendous. I, I, that uh, goal has been put up for my grandson and there is no way that I'm allowing him out here because I've got no crash barrier. Um, this fence in particular is only nine feet away from the edge of the A449 and that is just completely unacceptable. Constant. You'll get a lull because of the traffic lights and then all of a sudden you can count 30 seconds guaranteed constant, constant, constant. What would you like to see happen with the road as well? I know, I know it's a really important road, but what we need as far as health and safety and mental health as well, it's having a major impact on our mental health, is to reduce the speed and um, have some speed cameras. It, that's as simple as, as that. And I don't understand why they can't do that.